Suck, squeeze, bang, blow is how jet engines produce their thrust. Suck in air, compress it, combust, and exhaust it. Now, if it's your first time, you might be wondering exactly how does the banging process work? I'm an aerospace engineer, and it starts with a diffuser, slowing down the extremely fast airflow coming from the compressor. Then it gets divided, about 20%, into the combustion section, and the rest gets bypassed into the space between the chamber and the casing. That 20% flows through air swirlers into the primary zone. A spark plug ignites the initial fuel air mixture, but here's where it gets clever. The swirling air creates a recirculation vortex that traps those hot actively burning gases. Fresh fuel then mixes with these trapped super hot gases and ignites almost immediately. That's why the spark plug is only needed for startup. The flame becomes self-sustaining, unlike your car. But combustion is not complete yet. The partially burned gases then flow into the intermediate zone, where bypass air enters through secondary holes. The gases finish burning while the air leans out the mixture, keeping temperature temperature constant as combustion completes. The remaining bypass air dumps through dilution holes, rapidly cooling the exhaust to survivable temperatures for the turbine section downstream. 